This is what happens when I talk about things I know nothing about. You have to have a plan before you turn that camera on. Arla just got home. We did the whole thing that we have to do with her when she gets home from work. We came in from the house. We sat outside for a little bit after we went to um, her house. And um, after we sunbathed a little bit, just to, uh, you know, enhance our uh, tan leather bag look. look. We, well, I mowed the front, Dana mowed the back, and then we had the fucking shower. The pollen is frigging ridiculous. Uh, there were points where we can't, we couldn't breathe. I, I choked. I know. I just came out of the shower. We have some stuff in the washer and apparently I have to um, get, what the hell was I getting? Oh, that's right, cabbage. Let me find that because I don't know where the fuck it is. Be right back. I found the cabbage. Not here, but you know, whatever. Anyway, uh, we got a bunch of things going on. Sammy already had fries. Fries, right? She had fries. Oh shit, she had pasta. These are for Austin. Mm -hmm. He's got a burger coming, right? I don't know why I'm telling you about dinner when I'm not the one making it. Uh, okay, so Sammy He's had. Having a burger and disco fries, Austin. Hmm. I'm making it in the way. You are totally in the way. I am. There's bacon and uh, roasted veggies in the oven that she just took out. We're having burgers. She's making some coleslaw. She's also going to have some broccoli with butter and her spaghetti squash. I'm not having broccoli and butter. Somebody's having broccoli. Having having Nobody's having it. The kids are, are having it. That's it. Oh, shit. I'm fucking this all up. Woo! This is what happens when I talk about things I know nothing about. But you have to have a plan before you turn that camera on. No shit, because we know I can't speak right. Ain't no damn plan. Even if I have a plan, we already know that I can't. Yep. Whatever. See you later. This is dinner. Uh, two cheeseburgers with some bacon on top. Um, roasted broccoli and onions, just like last night for me. Actually, there's some bacon grease in there and simply seasoned coleslaw spaghetti swash. Did I say swash? I have no idea. Spaghetti to, squash to, and butter. I'm trying not to listen to you. Mm hmm Ice. It's just a classic lemonade, and this is my um, sauce of choice. We're going to bed. We're tired. I know I am. I can't really speak for Arlo, Hi, but... <sighs> I'm tired, though. We've... I don't know. We've just had a long day, though. Freaking grass. Yeah. A lot of excitement. The grass had whipped our ass. I know it whipped my ass, We're and I'm sure time. it whipped hers too, so. We're kind of tired, and look, I'm watching the fries. Anyway, you can shut it off. Here I am, they can still see me. Look, cause there's like a light. So we're going to bed. Oh, Chloe, might wanna let the cool dog, come on, Chloe. My eye's still swollen from, um, the freaking pollen. Anyway, so just want to say good night. night. Toodles. Good Monday morning. Arlo is sinking like fake AirPods that she bought for me. Well, she bought them for herself, but um, she's giving them to me so that I have like a pair. I have like those big ones that you put over your ears, which I used to use for the gym because I like to have like, I want to like completely, is it sound out or I don't know. I don't like to hear anybody else around me, so those do it for me, but these are good for home, like if I'm listening to a YouTube video or whatever. Um, so she's sinking, sinking those. Look at my hair. I just told Instagram I look like a, like a flower blossoming up there. 
and it's purple so it really really looks like it so this is what's happening here I am making three slices of bacon for me and then this is for her for dinner so you guys know we like the bacon grease to like I usually once this starts letting some grease out I'll take it out of the oven and then I'll kind of like you know tip it and then mix it around with the whatever vegetable we're roasting at the time so this is her little batch of green beans that she's having for dinner tonight I've got some steak that's defrosting over here I will be cooking that later and then she's gonna have some coleslaw for dinner but for breakfast today I made some uh, keto pancake batter the other day and she had McGriddles so she's gonna have that again I've got two pieces of sausage that are from the obviously freezer out she's gonna have two eggs with the McGriddles I'm making her two sandwiches and then these two eggs are mine I'm making a chaffle and if you don't know what that is I'll show you what it is I'm gonna actually make it with the uh, egg beaters today and cheese which is over there if you could see it yep right there so I'm gonna wrap this onion up because I only used a half of a half and uh, throw this in the oven I'm gonna season it right now probably put just like the basic salt pepper onion powder garlic powder and that is all and yeah that's that's breakfast today me for dinner I have no idea what I'm eating I may have an evolved meal because they need to be eaten we will see I don't know yet though but we'll see okay so this is a chaffle okay we have it's a small dash waffle maker so you add a tiny bit of shredded cheese to the bottom just a little and then you can either add regular eggs or egg beaters I'm using egg beaters today you add a little bit you fill it and then you add a little more cheese and then you close it and that's it you let it cook and I'll show you what it looks like when it's done so I'm going to show you what they look like. I like, I leave mine in a little longer. Like right now I could probably take it out, but I like it like super duper crispy. So that's what it looks like. And then, so what I'm going to do is I'm making an egg over, well, over easy over there. And then I'm going to add some bacon and that's going to be a sandwich. So got to make four of these. So this is what it pretty much looks like. I'm still waiting for another half to come out so I can put it on this side and then these are my breakfast sandwiches very simple to make they're delicious Arlo doesn't like them because they hurt her gums I don't know because they're, they're hard crunchy. no they're too crunchy for her so I like them though hi I'm not gonna show Arlo because she's indecent but I'm gonna show you what I'm doing out here she answers the phone at the wrong time somebody calls at the wrong time I know, but don't answer. You know it's I know, spam. Babe, I don't know who it is. Not all the time. All right, so let me show you. So we went to Lowe's the other day, and obviously this is coming with us when we move to the new house. But I wanted to show you that I just wanted some birds. Like, you can thank Mary Fry for all this, pretty much. I can't tag her, but you can thank her. <laughs> so I know you can make your own, but I don't want to right now. I'll probably make my own when we move to the other house. Because I'm not going to keep buying this, especially when you can make your own. So, I got this for the hummingbirds, this for the hummingbirds, and then obviously some seed for the regular birds that are around here. And then we got this thing here to actually put both those things on. It's nine feet tall. This way the squirrels don't ruin everything. And then we got this really nice bird feeder, which I'm very excited for. And I'm having an iced espresso. So I'm going to put this together and then I'll show you the finished product once it's all done. All right, so there it is. I got that guy up there. And you see how tall the pole is? Pretty tall. And then I got, I didn't fill it all the way up because why not? Why do I have to fill it all the way up? So yeah, and then it's all the way down there. Exciting. Good morning. Good Tuesday morning. Today is the 2nd of June. I have to look at the calendar. Isn't that terrible? Okay, so I'm going to make myself some coffee right now. Because I need it. And what else is happening? Nothing really. Just, um, just need coffee. That's it. Where's my cup at? Anyway. Um, it's supposed to be hot today, like really hot, so I 
have the air on. Yesterday I had the air off most of the day. I put it on pretty late last night, like right before I went to bed. So, I mean, I'm trying to like give it a break, you know, because I mean, well, air conditioning is expensive. But, just filling up my water to add to my coffee pot. Um, so yeah, today and tomorrow is supposed to be pretty hot. So I don't know what it's going to be like on Thursday, but I right know today and tomorrow is going to be a hot one. Anywho, uh, tomorrow we have to, because of the quarantine, obviously you guys know that Austin's high school has been having a graduation, like an in-person graduation. So tomorrow this is the diploma pickup. And then you can take a picture on the field or something. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how it's going. All I know is it says that he's got to be there between 10:45 and I mean 11:45 and 11:50. And then um, make sure he wears his cap and gown, and he's allowed up to four four people to take a picture with him. So, I mean, obviously just me and Arlo's going because his dad <coughs> doesn't even live near here. And he has no way to get here anyway. So, fortunately, that's that. Um, I mean, but other than that, there's nothing really happening. I had a really good night's sleep last night, which I'm surprised because normally I don't sleep well. But I slept well last night, so I ain't gonna complain. Arlo said she had a pretty decent night at work, which is good. She's off Wednesday and Friday this week, and then she works the weekend and Monday, and then off Tuesday, Wednesday. Anywho, um, the guy that normally moves us when we move, um, he's actually, Arlo asked him, and he's willing to help us move, well, move us, so that's good. But I can't give him a date, because we don't know. It's going to be in July sometime. Anywho. I'm going to let the dogs in because they are outside and I will talk to you guys when she wakes up. Remember this morning I told you I'd get back on here when Arlo woke up? Well, she's been up for hours. There she is. Playing with her hair. Anyway, we had... Oh, I didn't show you. Motherfucker. Look at her hair. <laughs> Insert lunch photo. Now! <laughs> but I'll tell you what it was. So we had nachos with the cut the carb wraps. We each have one wrap, which is nine net carbs. So, net, right? Or total? Net. net. Um, and then, what else did we have? Um. Oh, so I made like a Philly cheese steak situation. Bye, Ma. Love you too. Philly cheese steak. Like, so I use steak gums. All right. Uh, steakums, a couple of sweet peppers, and uh, a medium, a half of a medium onion. So I had that that I had cooked up previous before I fried up the chips, and then I made the chips, and then I put some um, Mexican blend cheese on top, and it was absolutely delicious. So it wasn't your tra traditional nachos, but it was so good. It was really good. I enjoyed. I enjoyed it so much. We enjoyed it so much. <sighs> okay, so it's like almost midnight. Am I clear? Yeah. Come on. I just let the dog in. Um, Arlo just got home. We did the whole thing that we have to do with her when she gets home from work because she works in a nursing home and we already know. I mean, that's how she got COVID to begin with. Uh, so I meet her in the garage. She changes her clothes at work. She puts her, you know, I have like a cloth, um, like a reusable bag. So she puts her uniform and everything in there. And then when she comes home, I throw that right into the wash. And now uh, she goes straight into the shower. She leaves her shoes in a box that's in the garage. And now she is taking a shower. So I'm lowering the temperature in the house. It's getting cooler in here. 
Uh, tomorrow, Austin has a, it's called the diploma ceremony, or it's really not even a ceremony. I mean, because it's only him and us. So, um, we have to be there at 11.45, and then I have to give Chloe her medicine. We have to be there at 11.45, and then um, they do, I mean, they give him his diploma, and then they take pictures, and I don't know, something like that. It's just him, though. It's like not him and his classmates. It's him, because obviously he's not allowed to be around his classmates. So, that's that. Um... So that's that. It's supposed to be really warm tomorrow. Arlo is off from work tomorrow, which is nice. So I'm happy she's off tomorrow. And, oh, I'm trying to move the dog's bed. Watch out, Chloe. And um, so it's me, Samantha, and Arlo going to this thing tomorrow. I asked him if he wanted to. No, get off, the, get off for a minute. Come on. Come on. Look at this crazy dog. Come on, move. Get out of the way. Come on, Chloe, get down. Come on, no, 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 off, off. Come on, ay, ay, ay. Chloe, get down. No, <laughs> get down, on the bed. Oh my goodness. She, she will drive anybody wild. <laughs> Anywho, I asked Austin if he wanted to tell his father. He didn't want to. I don't think his father would be able to go anyway, but he's 18, he makes the decision. It isn't my responsibility at his age to make that decision for him. Either he wants him there or he doesn't want him there. It's not my responsibility. When he was younger, I did what I could to bring them two together. But he's older now and I'm not making that decision anymore if you catch my drift. Uh, so that's that. I'm going to change, get in bed, and get a good night's sleep. And I'll see you guys in the morning. Might bring you in the car with us. Obviously, I'm not going to bring you to the ceremony. But I will bring you in the car. <laughs>